A local crime alert. An accused copper crook caught red-handed tonight. Cops say DeAndre Bramlett broke into a Raleigh church to steal its wiring. In fact, over the past week, the Living and Life Victory Church has been vandalized not once or twice, but three times. Only this time, the pastor was ready. Local 24 News reporter Tish Clark live at the church on Austin P tonight. So Tish, tell us what happened. All right, so Richard, you know, this all happened and unfolded, this arrest and everything happened through teamwork. So church members say they'd had enough. They set a trap just in case they were hit again. We just had a gut feeling, so we just sat, pulled a plan together. That plan paid off. Pastor Henry Lavender and his wife Lori say thieves have been stripping their church's training center of copper wiring, causing thousands of dollars worth of damage. Church members decided to take action. They left the lights on, installed cameras, and waited. Around 2.30 Wednesday morning, Memphis police were called when the pastor noticed the lights had been turned off. And they ran inside the police department. The and uh, they apprehend the guy in the in very act taking copper. Police arrested and charged DeAndre Bramlett with burglary. With the amount of damage and what's been going on here, it's more than, it's more than one person. We, we think that he has some accomplices. MPD is investigating. In the meantime, Pastor Lavender and his congregation plan to pick up the pieces and move forward. We have not lost vision or hope. No. Uh, we're fighters and we're a church, so a church, a church with faith. All right, so coming up at six, hear from folks who've lived in this Raleigh neighborhood a really long time, several years. What they say about crime and copper, why it's such a hot commodity, and what people most likely who steal it will do with it. That's coming up tonight at six. We're live in Raleigh tonight. Tish Clark, Local 24 News.